All right, so we're gonna start our Kerbal Space career today. Uh, kind of a bad day for me to start because my voice is killing me after my long stream I did a few days ago. But uh, we are starting our Kerbal Space Home career, so let's get it started. All right, name's Waffle, of course. Uh, I actually made a flag. Let's see if we can find it. Um, oh, there it is. Waffle flag. Apply. Accept. Oh, yeah. We got our own flag now. Hell yes. All right. And we're doing a career mode. So this should be it. Uh, career. We're going to have to deal with funds, reputation, and science. Sounds great. Uh, overwrite the name. Yes. I already made a test account. All right. Here we are. All right. So this is, I guess, I, I've never really played the game before, so I have no idea what we're doing. But I guess let's just get started. I have no idea what any of these buildings are. Let's uh, let's go through each of the buildings and see what we have to do. All right, this looks like a this looks like a tree of some sort. What is this? Uh, technology we started out with. Okay, so these are the parts we have. If I understand this correctly, you only start off with a few parts, and you have to research stuff to be able to get more parts. To research, I believe you need science, and to get science, you have to do missions. Kind of, if I understand correctly. So we have some engines. We okay, this is good. Uh, science archives. Whoa. Oh, cool. I guess you got all the, like, the, the moons and the planets and everything and the sun. Nice. Okay, cool. So I guess everything we do, this will tell us where it is. Okay, so if I want to get here, uh, I need five science. And right now I have zero science. So how do we get some science then? Okay, what is that? <laughs> This is our mission control? Oh my god, okay, this is- wait, contracts. These are contracts, alright. So here's our current contracts, it says the active, the archives, and the available. Alright, so we- These are some of our missions we have to do. Um... So we need to launch a new vessel and set an altitude record of 5,000 5, meters. I can easily do that. Um... Escape the atmosphere. Why do you do that? Oh, launch above 70,000, okay, and orbit. Huh. Above 70,000. That's no problem. All right, so let's do this. Let's accept the contract to make a new vessel uh -huh. And let's also accept the contract to get the 5,000. I think at the same, we could do it at the same time. All right so This is our command pod. We're gonna build a rocket around this uh, We don't really have a lot of stuff just some solid rocket boosters To get to uh, we're only got to go to 5,000. That's not that hard. Uh, do we have any other structures here? We don't Okay I think we can get to 5,000 this way. I don't want to put too much on this because it's probably going to blow up if we're not careful. And if it blows up, I know we can't recover stuff. So even, I don't think one parachute's going to be enough to for, recover this. I think we're going to need more than that. How expensive is, oh, you can see a price. These are 420, okay, a piece, 420. And so I don't know how many of these we want to use. But maybe, hmm, this may or may not work. All right, this is the SS Waffle launch. It should be the first one. I think we're, I think Jeb is in here. Oh gosh, we have Jeb piloting in this. This will go well. Let's see. All right, take off in three, two, one. Oh, okay, it's working well. We need the 5,000. Our goal is 5,000. All right, we've easily blown past 5,000, by the way. I was right. We really didn't need that many fuel kinks. Oh, I forgot to... Uh-oh. I forgot to uh, save some fuel. Uh-oh, that's not good. I was going to save some fuel so we could actually slow down our descent, but I completely forgot to, so... Oh, God. Uh... And deploy. All right, that'll slow us down a bit. We're coming in really fast. There we go. Ooh. All right, parachute deployed. All right, 10 meters a second might be too fast right now. Uh-oh. This is going to be a hard one. Uh-oh. Coming in hot. Ooh. Okay. That was like we just rode the shockwave. That's what made us survive. We used the shockwave to slow us down. All right, we are good. Jeb, we are good, right? Roger, Jeb? Jeb? Yes. Ow. We're okay. Very good. Very good. Well, that was successful, I think. Cover. Um, science. 
Recover a vessel that survived flight. Next. Five science to that, okay? Parts. Oh, cool, we cover all this. So we have command pod, mark, parry, okay, we're done. So we cover that too, all right? And Jeb, we need to recover him too, so recover Jeb. 25 reputation to recover him, nice. All right, so we're good to go. All right, so at the science building, I want to, I think I want to buy this next, right? This gives us some more fuel tanks, gives us some more, yeah, more fuel tanks. Uh, mystery goo containment unit. Ooh. Uh, and a stack decoupler. Let's buy that. So let's get some of these big fuel tanks and let's make ourselves a nice rocket. But before we do this, let's put a stack decoupler on there. All right. Oh, if we'd like these go, hmm. We're not going to be able to recover these, are we? I bet we can't. Hmm. All right. New strategy. We're going to use this as our main unit. This will be our main rocket. All right, we need to put a goo machine on here. How expensive is this? 800, okay, one goo machine. Make it look nice. And I also want an antenna. All right, is that on the door? Oh, don't put it on the door, bad idea. Pfft. Put it over here, all right. We're already at four. We're already at four thousand two hundred. Okay, now we have that, which is good. So solid rocket booster assist to get up, and then we have three main tanks that might get it. That might barely get us in the orbit. And then we have another tank up here. All right, this will probably not work. So, or, you know what? Let's let's put six on. That looks good. That'll work. I bet this will work. All right, this is the SS Penis Jebediah. You're a go for launch in three, two, one. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. That is, that is wiggling out of portion right now. All right. How are we doing? That is at 50,000. We gotta get, they said we gotta get to 70,000. Push it back over here. All right, separate. Next stage, go. Whoa! We do not have a lot of fuel. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh, calm. Oh, okay, power down. We have like no fuel right now. In hindsight, I should make this bigger. All right, what is this at right now? 100,000? All right, stop. That is good. In three, two, one, go. It's very difficult to keep this thing pointed straight, I'm not gonna lie. Hold on. Oh, did we do it? Oh, we did it! We did it! We did it, guys! We totally did it! Okay, good. And we actually just have a little fuel left. Now, this is a terrible orbit, but you know what? It's not that bad. It's not that bad. I think we did it. Okay, good. I think we want to recover this, but right now it's not really possible. We have like no fuel. So landing this back at Kerman is probably a bad idea. So we're going to leave this in orbit for now. Jeb, where are you? Come out here, Jeb. Ah, there you are. Here's Jeb. Oh, he's so cute. Here he is. Face it this direction. <laughs> oh, Jeb, you're flying away. What are you doing? Oh, no. Jeb, back to the rocket. Back to the... Jeb, where's it going? Jeb, back. Jeb, does the goo say anything? I think the goo is the same intelligence as Jeb. Get a pod. Okay. So, we gotta test each of these engines, so we have to do multiple at a time. So... And this has to land again as well. All right, so we have one big rocket this time. We have Bill Kerbin as our pilot, and here we go. In three, two, one. Our mission is to get to 21,000 meters. 21,000 meters is not that far. We should be able to do it pretty easily, in my opinion. And we're trying a new technology. We're trying a new engine, the LT, I think it's the LT, the LV-909 and the Separatrons. 
Let's see what we can do about staging here. All right, almost 7,000. It's not bad. We got about we need to double this height. We only have one more engine to be able to do that. Here we go. Oh, I like that. That worked nicely. All right, we're gaining altitude. All right, with this one engine, we got to go pretty gosh dang high. We got to go 21,000. So I think it'll be a lot easier just to go straight up. So we're going to go straight up and hopefully 10,000 more meters. Uh-oh. We need to hit that speed at the right time, which means we need to go down. 22,000 at 460 meters a second. Um, um, all right, I think it'd be better to do a new mission. Uh-oh. Oh, 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 yes. Bill, you're, you're the best, Bill. All right, the parachute is gone, but we are good. Bill, congratulations. You have landed successfully. All right, let's get out of here and go recover that vehicle, and then I guess we can do the next mission. So this is the SS Waffle Mark IV. This is, mission is to test out a specific part at an exactly the right altitude, 22,000 meters. We need to activate it, but we need to be going 500 meters a second as well. So that's gonna be kind of hard to do, in my opinion. But we're gonna try it out, yo. Three, two, one. Oh, that's extremely fast. That is super fast. That is really, really, really fast. Separate, all right. We gotta go 500 meters a second. Let's crank this bad boy up. We're way too fast. Are all requirements met? Activate. All right, we're good. We have met all the mission requirements. Um, now the only problem is that we're far, or we're way over water. Hmm. All right, we're gonna let gravity do its thing right now. And we should land somewhere outside. The, we should land around here, I think. Wow, this is the best landing I've ever had. I've never landed so close to the actual space center. I usually land like a million miles off. I'm actually gonna land like at it. I know I wasn't that far away or anything, but still, like, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, here comes the landing. Engage the booster. We're almost there. Oh, that was the best landing ever. Oh, baby, that was good. Oh, yes. Oh, that was so good. Can we do both of these at the same time? That's my question. All right, can we do these here and get credit for both of those? I guess we're going to find out. All right, here we go. We're going to have full power here and... Is going really well so far. I believe we actually finished two missions there. So, only have to get to 18,000 feet with this. And go within 100 meters a second or so. Alright, 100 to 200 and 18,000. We can do this, I believe. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, wait. Pack it in again. Pack it in. Pack it in. Cut. No, don't cut it. Don't cut it. No, don't cut it. No. No. Oh, my gosh. Oh, crap. You're in good hands. You're in my hands. And you know where my hands have been. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We got this. Planet, planet, planet. Uh oh, no, no, no! Oh, no! Yeah, we were so close! No, we fell like 10 feet, no! Oh my gosh! Alright, this is the SS Waffle Mark 6, kind of. It's named Mark 5, but it is a Mark 6. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and do it. Remember, we're getting to 18,000 meters at 100 meters a second. 100 to 300. We're not going fast enough right now. All right, we're good. 
All right, I tested it. I have the mission complete now. All right, good. Successful mission. Uh, as long as we don't die. I hope we don't die. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! What happened? Oh! Oh! Yes! 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 Oh my god, yes! Oh! Yes! Oh, baby, yes! Bob, you're, you're the best! Oh my god, Bob is the new... My new favorite pilot right now. Oh! Oh, yes! Oh my god. Whew. I butt clenched so hard right there. Our parachute, like, decided that it was done. And I guess we had a failure, or maybe it was... I don't know what it thought. Oh, we did it, though. Oh my gosh. I thought we were gonna lose another Kerbin. I was so sad for a second. Oh, Space Center. Oh. Well, if you like what you saw, come back next time for more adventures in Kerbal Space Program. Uh, so far, we've, we've only lost one Kerbin, which is good, but I'm sure we'll lose a few more next time. But science cannot advance without, you know, losses and sacrifices. And Jeb is here to prove that. He is stuck in space until we can come rescue him. But we're only going to rescue him if it's for a mission. So we might, it it's, we need to refuel this ship. It might take us a while to get another refueler out here. But thanks for watching.